Facts. And I noticed y'all, at least at least do. Jay, he said he is strictly for his people or he's strictly for his race. I've heard people they interpret race first as yeah, you are for your race first, but you don't mind building coalitions and alliances with other racial groups or other group of people, but your people still come first. Do y'all agree with that or not? For me personally, um, oh, but before I answer that, is she trying to, y'all see this other person in the room listening? She says she's she trying to join. Is that cool with y'all? She black. Yeah, that's cool. Shit, you can't really right. hear everybody, so, honestly. I, I didn't know this was going to be a private thing, but shit. <laughs> Hell yeah. Like, I'm out of here right now. But uh, what you just said, in my opinion, bro, like, no, I don't believe we should uh, work together with any race at all. Because it, um, it never worked, bro. Like, it never did. I don't care what anybody said, all that Martin Luther King shit. Like, no, it didn't, nothing, none of, it didn't work, bro. Like, I'm gonna just be honest with you. None of it worked. And every time we did it, we got backstabbed, we got screwed over, this, that, and the third. So, even then, bro, like, it's just not healthy for our people in general. Because, like, history done showed it, backstabbed, culture getting stolen, robbed, plundered. No, like, it only, it, at this point, it's just, they all gotta go, bro. Like, that's just what it is. It's full separation is what I'm, what I'm praying, not not praying, fuck that. It's what I'm killing for. Facts, facts, facts. I'm uh, trying to add it. I don't know how to. I don't agree to with speak. that. Hold on a second. Um, and I know how it's easy to interpret race first in that kind of way. Um, mm-hmm. but I don't agree with it. Um, I'm strictly for my race. I'm strictly for my people. And when I say race first, I just mean, like I said, moving with intent with my people and my race. And everything that I do. Your thing faded. Say it again. My your thing faded. I can't hear. Hold on. Give me a second. You can hear me? Yeah. You can hear me good? Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you good. You straight, you straight, you straight. All right, bet. I just said I don't agree with that. Mainly because I mean I can see how it's easy for them to interpret race first in that kind of way, but I don't agree with it. Um I'm stripping for my race and stripping for my people. And like I said, race first to me is moving with intention with your people um, in mind and everything that you do. So I don't agree with no type of coalitions or no type of unity with any other racial group or anything like that. Um, <laughs> it just simply don't work. It don't work. Um, but I feel like it's better if we just, first of all, let me say this. We not even unify within our own people, whether it's locally or internationally. So how are we trying to unify with other racial groups in any, in any capacity? Let's focus on us that's, that's and true. take care of us. And not just us first, but us only. And that's that's kind of where I'm at. Hey, y'all. Oh, what's up? Did oh, you get my, you did you get my message, Flo? Uh, on here? Yeah. No, check really check your message. You yeah, check messages. your message request. But um, I love what you guys are saying. Um, I definitely agree with definitely, what you guys definitely. are saying. Um, Appreciate that one, guys. No. Yes, I'm black. I'm black American. <laughs> yeah, we have to make sure, though. You know what I'm saying? Man. Nah, facts, bro. It definitely be some weirdos on here trying to act like they black and shit like that. Shit crazy. Yeah, no, I, I'm Black American, born and raised. I was born in Seattle, raised in Houston. Um, That's yeah. Um. So I All have right, a so question, so though. The, oh, sorry. Well, uh, um, oh no, you go, you go. Uh, I don't want to cut off his question. So he, he basically said, okay, yeah, we didn't have unity in our race. Not if we were gonna work with anybody else. That's the truth, though, because we don't, my nigga. But uh, uh, I wanted uh, know me. Uh, I want you to answer that question too, and Flo, Flo, I don't think you answered it yet about if we agree about if we agree with uh, working together with other races. No, yeah, me, you can, can answer that. She you can go tap in too. I'll go after her. Right, y'all both tap in. Um, no, I don't think we need to do that. <laughs> I don't think that it's necessary for us to be successful. I think we've proven time and time again that we don't. We actually should do the antithesis. Um. Mm-hmm. Also, um, yeah, that's that, that's pretty much what I what I think. I'm not sure. Flow. Uh, 
Yeah, I would say uh, basically I, I think that is uh, the difference between race first and pro-black because I think oh, okay. pro-black is like, yeah, you can put people your people first, but you do have that option or, you know, you know, option to like, you know, fuck with others and shit like that. So I think when you race first, um, and, and for me, for any nigga who ha- like has a rebuttal for that, I would say that um, mm-hmm. as much issues as we have in the black community, if even if we spent all our resources, time and attention on every single issue, we would still need more people and more resources to deal with those issues. So we literally have no issue. I mean, we have no resources or time and attention to tend to nobody else's shit but our shit. So, um, you know, if you have an issue with us saying we should only focus on us, you don't really care about the community because you don't realize how many issues that need to be solved. And, and we worried about other races and we ain't solved shit in our yeah. community yet. Thanks, thanks, thanks. That's true. That shit is embarrassing how we literally try to help everybody else, but we got the worst problems. We don't have the to worst. deal with the most. Like, we don't got killed off the most. We don't have to deal with so much extortion, all type of weird stuff. Like, we really trying to clean that up. We trying to clean niggas in Ukraine. Like, man, what? That shit don't even make any sense. We don't even have our own culture, and niggas is trying to worry about somebody else. At least other races got their culture, and you know what I'm saying? They, other races, they didn't have their family stripped apart. And, you know, like, if you from St. Louis, you probably got a cousin in Texas. If you from Texas, you got you probably got a cousin in South Carolina because our families were stripped apart. So, you know, we ain't even got our right. family structure. We don't even have, you know what I'm saying, uh, a solid foundation in the home. And we worried about fixing another race right. issues. This shit crazy. Um, can like, I, say, can I is, say something? That's true. Yeah. Um... So, I'm I'm definitely pro-black, right? No. 